Hey guys, uh, so today was a pretty great day. Uh, we went to this orchard, um, I forgot the name of it. Um, you can just scroll down on my page and see the name right there. Um, it was pretty cool, they had a lot of produce, it was really packed with people. Um, apparently it's fresh produce that they grow right there in the area and it's pretty good. I had an apple from there. Uh, I also had some grapes and it's the first time I've eaten natural grapes. They're very different. They have a lot of seeds in them and they taste very different. Uh, they were I guess you call red grapes or purple grapes. Um, and I got my new computer. It's not new. Um, I got it from my uncle. I'm very thankful for that. Uh, it's working really well. Um, it seems all the updates are done right now. Um, it has 4 gigs of RAM, which is good. It's kind of a small hard drive at 120 gigabytes, but that's not much of a problem when you have online storage these days. I use Google Drive myself. And I have an extra hard drive with me, but I'm not going to try installing that yet. I don't want to mess anything up. Um, my only question is, I don't know what kind of graphics card it has. Um, of course, it has some sort of internal graphics thing going on, because, of course, you just hook a monitor to it and it works. Uh, I did notice some stuttering on YouTube. But that was when I was doing a lot of updates, so maybe it's better now. I haven't tested it. I've been kind of busy. Uh, I haven't been on the computer much today. Um, good thing, though, um, you can find graphics cards very cheap off the internet. You know, even 20 bucks um, can get me a decent graphics card. It can get you uh, graphics for your video games that are about equivalent to a PS2. And for about 50 or 60, it can look as good as, like, PS3. I don't plan on running games at very high resolutions. I don't really care about that. The monitor is really nice. It can do a very high resolution. I think it's something like 19, yeah, 1920 by 1080, uh, which is great. But actually, the uh, internal graphics does not support that, which is a big hint right there that it might not be the best. So getting a graphics card will fill that resolution, but still, I usually keep my resolutions pretty low. Um, I'm, I don't really have the best eyesight, so if you keep them low, uh, everything's nice and big, and the computer runs better all around. Uh, I'm pretty happy with 720p. Uh, 1080p is great, too. Uh, I plan to play games at about 720p, so that should allow me to have most of the graphical effects turned up pretty high uh, compared to, you know, some of these these crazy PC gamers out here running like 4K games and stuff. You know, that high resolution is really going to, you know, it's going to kill uh, a lot of other options. I'd rather have it a bit lower resolution and have it look prettier that way. And I'm used to console games, and right now uh, I think the sweet spot is 720p or, or 1080p. So um, I want to talk to you guys about a vitamin, a supplement that I take, and I would like to recommend to you guys. Um, of course, I'm not a doctor, as with all of these vitamins, as the bottle says, talk to your doctor about using it. Um, this vitamin is called valerian root. This one is three, 530 milligrams. And it's good stuff. And it says here, traditionally used for calm, tranquil rest. Um, comes with 100 in this bottle. And, yeah, that's the main use for it, is to help you sleep. Uh, so, obviously, if you're having trouble sleeping, you got to get up for work or whatever, 
Take these about an hour before you go to bed, or depending on your metabolism. If you have experience with taking medication or vitamins, you know uh, that you know for some re some people it's 15 minutes, some people it's an hour, some people it's two to three hours. Um, right here, recommended. I mean, it's not recommended. But the directions tell you that adults are supposed to take four capsules an hour before bed. I think four is a little much, but hey, if you really got to go to sleep, you can take four. Um, and just to let you know, you can take a lot of these if, if you feel so inclined. Um, obviously, um, you know, it goes without saying. Um, if you take too many, you might have liver problems, who knows, you could in, end up getting whatever you get, you know, like gallstones or, or whatever it is, um, you know, just like any kind of supplement or medication you take. But I really recommend it. I'll tell you what I do. Sometimes in the morning, I might take one if I'm feeling uh, extra, like, nervous that day. I'll take one, and it doesn't make me sleepy. If I take one later in the day, like at five, it will make me a little sleepy. Um, that's what I've found. But, you know, it might be a good help if you get a sort of anxious uh, nervousness in social situations. Um, you can just take one of these before you go out, and it might relax you a bit. Um, but if you're prone to getting sleepy, then, you know, don't take it. And you can't really cut these in half. There are, they're in capsules. And, you know, they're just like herbs in capsules. They also sell these as tinctures, which would be interesting. Um, but yeah, they're just little capsules here. So you can't really cut them in half. I mean, I guess you could. You could pop it in half, you know, pour it out. Put it in a tea or something not a bad idea actually so yeah what I usually do the max I ever take is three to go to sleep besides I'm trying to save money speaking of which these are only about five dollars I found these at uh, Family Dollar for about they were like 430 something so that's a really great deal so that is my main topic for today um, so tomorrow I want to show, I guess I might show you my computer, um, if I don't show you the computer, I might be showing you my new vape tank, I really like it, it's called a super tank, and it has a ceramic coil, I think that, uh, I think that cool, that honeycomb looking, uh, what would you call it? intake, the juice intake is pretty badass. It's pretty cool. I'll show you guys a demonstration. So, it works very well. I'll tell you that was only at 19 watts. I don't crank this thing up too high. Um, this can go up to 40 watts. Um, I know that doesn't mean anything to most people who don't use these. Um, but hey, I'd recommend it. If you're buying those blues, those are very expensive. If you're buying the blue refills, those are also very expensive. But with this, this becomes a real hobby. And you might not really be interested in doing all of that. Other than that, I'd recommend maybe have this at home. And then have your blues when you're out on the go. You don't have to worry. Um, you know, it's it has been said that these leak. Mine never leak. But I just make sure to you just make sure to keep it upright. You know, I'm not shaking it around a lot. Uh, they even sell little holsters you can buy to put on your belt if you're really worried about it leaking. Uh, putting it in the back pocket is great. Of course, don't sit on it. Usually, when I go to sit down, I have to put it on a table. Uh, just to be safe. So, alright, thank you for watching. Uh, this video is getting a little too long. And I hope you guys are having a great um, uh, fall. 
I don't know, it feels like winter around here. I have my trusty clock up here and it's telling me that the temperature in my room right now is 69, that's pretty crazy. But hey, we're trying to save uh, on electricity and I got clothes in the dryer. I got me a new pair of uh, long pajamas thanks to my aunt. So things are going pretty great and I'll see you tomorrow. Have a great evening.